Okay, so Backbone, I've been waiting to play this game for a long time. Um, I just, I'm a sucker for, for beautiful pixel art. This has beautiful pixel art. And it just reminds me of one of my favorite comics, uh, Black Sad. Another detective, anthropomorphic, and other animals disguise. It's an awesome comic. Definitely check that one out too. Yeah, so the controls are simple. Oh, cool. There's no options for like music or sound. Okay, well, let's just go on with the game then. I like that. I like this guy's priorities. He likes to read. Oh, there are no voiceovers yet. Okay. Sorry. Missed your call. Yeah, no. Oh, wait. Just enough time to clean up. Okay. AD. Yeah, standard. E to interact. Also standard. But is there, there's no mouse. Okay, cool, 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 cool. This damn thing stopped working a long time ago. Gotta hit Frankie up next time I'm in Fustel. When I have cash. So, never. Call cool, mom. Buy soap. Pay bills. Don't die. Wise words. I, I think, you know, that advice is going to take you a long way. Leaving developers in the kitchen is a sure road to poisoning. Or a great soup. Never know. I don't think anyone has ever tried to have um, negative soup. That's that window. Hard to get tired of this view. Not a big toilet. The Great Apes, the Great Story. Swell toilet read. Better leave it here. Oh man, you're like me. I've got a book in the toilet. I've got a book that I travel with to work. I've, you know, you gotta have multiple books. You you can't just like read one story. Just like you can't just play one game. You have to enjoy several different games. What's this? Oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. Everything knows its proper place. Heh. <laughs> Making a little joke to himself. Insurance frauds, lost cars, estranged lovers. Probably get rid of some of these old case files. Eventually. Yes. Yeah, Let's see what's on the desk here. Can I use the mouse now? Oh, I can. Cool, cool. But I guess... Dangly feet. Is that a uh, matched it? Yeah, it's matched it. I, I thought it might be something else. Cool. There's nothing else to do here. Okay. Okay, well, let's carry on. Nope, we're not carrying on. Wait a minute, I'm putting the dishes in... Okay, cool, man. You know... You live in a small apartment. Oh, that must be Mrs. Green. Let's go talk to Mrs. Green. Hello? I don't know why he sounds so London. Excuse me, I'm looking for Detective Latour. He spoke on the phone? Mm -hmm. 
Gather you have a case for me, Mrs. Green? At your service, Mrs. Green. Trust you've had a pleasant day. Mrs. Green, can I help you? You were vague when we spoke before. I'm gonna... Mm, uh, please, Odette is fine. And I'd rather be discreet with this matter, that's all. Noted. What we're dealing with. The information I gather from clients is strictly confidential, I assure you. Any particular reason for said discretion? I don't nose around. Let, let's be, let's stay professional. Number two, I'd pick number two. I'd, yeah. It's always a pleasant, pleasant to deal with a professional. So what's the matter at hand? I, um, well, I understand this sort of thing is routine in your line of work. It's about my husband, you see. Oh, is he cheating again? <laughs> That's actually one of your options. Okay, cool. Do you suspect he's cheating? Yes, I'm pretty sure. You see, he's been acting so strange lately. And every time I try to talk to him, he gets... But no matter. I just need proof that will hold up in court. Court? Are you filing for divorce? That's none of my business. Do you try talking? None of my business. If he's indeed having an affair, I can get you what you want. Um, understood. I need a professional. Understood. Of course. A anything you need. What would you like to know? Where can I find him usually? What does he look like? Have you met any of his friends? What's his full name? The name would be... I don't need to know a name. What does he look like? What does he look like? Here's a photo. He's an otter, of course. Of course, you know. A uh, lot A bit shorter than you and kind of chunky. He wears glasses, the square kind. And his wedding band has, as far as I know, Oh, and he carries a black briefcase to and from work. From work, you say? Where can I find him usually? Well, supposedly he goes to work and then comes home. But I know sometimes he goes somewhere else after work. Occasionally before, now it's become more frequent. Hold up. How do you know he goes somewhere else after work? He hasn't been hiding well. His behaviour is all abnormal. He gets home late, misses work, lies and smells funny. What's the funny smell? Like perfume. Not mine. Alcohol, smoke. And something else I can't pinpoint, but it's poignant. A kind of herbal stink. Um, and let's talk case details. I need picture information about his routine. Alright, let's get stuff. Let's talk about your husband's personal details. Don't just get home when you let. I think we're, we're going to need to know as much information as we can, so we just go for all these. Uh, start with the first one. How do you know he's been missing work? Apes. I feel so ashamed. He's going to get terminated if he continues like this. I've gotten calls. At first they wondered if he was homesick. I lied for him for a couple of times too. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Um, so you, you've caught him like? He's bad at it. Makes lame excuses about where he's been. At what time does he get home when he's late? Way past hours. Unreasonably so and, and drunk. One time I stayed up and asked what he was doing. It didn't go well. Hold up. Has he been aggressive? I can handle it if he's been aggressive. 
I won't charge extra. I really don't think it's relevant, Mr. Latour, and I'd rather move on. Okay, we'll, we'll keep it professional. Uh, about court, about case details. Uh, have you met any of his friends? I haven't met them, but he mentions some guys from time to time. Sometimes he hangs out with them after work. What's his full name? Jeremy Green. I think people at work call him Jez for short. And and where does he work? At the Wolf Bank. <laughs> Wolf Bank. On Granville. I can write the address down for you. Any way I'd be able to pick him out of a crowd. Well, I lay his clothes out from every morning. He has to wear a suit for work. I pick out his green tie and hat for him today. That's all I need. Now the awkward part. Payment. I can give you a hundred now and fifty when you're done. Would that be enough? Yes. Plus any unexpected expenses during the investigation. <coughs> Hot dog. <coughs> I've got a lot riding on this and I only got one shot. Funds are limited, you know. Uh, what assurance can you make that you're the right man for the job? You're good at what I do. Okay. I bet my tail you're here because someone recommended me. Damn, Skippy. You're not wrong. But that's one case I know you've helped sort. Are there others? Please. That's confidential. That's not very... I, I'm offering confidentiality for your case. I'm good at what I do, Odette. If I wasn't, I wouldn't be allowed to practice. I hope so. It's very important you don't get caught. Do you understand? Of course. I'll get right on it, Odette. Talk soon. I... I hope my... Gravelly voice for him isn't distracting. Um, if it is, just <laughs> let me know. <laughs> um, I, I love putting on voices for these characters. Okay, so uh, press tab to access detective menu. Here we go for the detect. Okay, close and detective menu. Cool. I've got my inventory. That's how he looks like. He, he is indeed an otter with a green hat. And the picture of Odette's husband doesn't really strike you like a sleazy skirt chaser. No, he's kind of... Hmm. No. Nah. <laughs> Objective, uh, find Jeremy Green in evidence of infidelity. Works out Wolf Bank on Granville. It's a good place to start. Tidy up before the client light. Oh yeah, I've done that already. Um, my office. Notes to self. Reminder to call mum. It's not difficult to remember, just difficult to stop procrastinating. <laughs> uh, media set is bricked again. Frankie could probably fix it, but I'd have to take it all the way to Fussdale. Oh, what a fuss. Client Odette Green wants proof of her husband's affair to get a divorce and win custody of their children. Valence was grabbing on there. Should be easy peasy. Okay, is there anything left to in here? I don't think there is. No, nah, there isn't. Let, let's let's go. Let's go to the Wolf Bank. The Wolf Bank. <laughs> I just like saying that Wolf. Yeah, so so far I'm enjoying the game. I'm a bit intrigued. They, they're starting us with an easy case. Ah. See, this is why I, I picked this game. This, I, ah. It's just, it's so beautiful. 
Ranville smells like wet concrete, overpriced fast food and puke. My kind of battleground. Indeed, indeed. Vermin. One slick, silver-tongued devil of a mountain lion. When I go crazy and kill someone, I hope I can afford him. Oh. <laughs> um. The Great Apes. The Great Story. Documentary. A story of order. A story of courage. A story of justice. This has been running for a year now. Wow, it must be good. The day I bought a bike, Citizen Main, Johnny and John don't drive. Oh, I love this. And see how everyone is animated as well. It is a lot. This is really well made. I love this. I love it. Eden Simmons is on the rising jazz star. See her tonight, only at Bike Club. Neat. Should I check this out once I'm done the case? Yes, you should. Yes, you should. Wolfbank, this is where Green works. Yeah, I don't see him yet. And as a bank employee. Who these? Here's the bite. Hmm. Might not quite fit in with this fancy crowd. Thankfully, I'm a charming boy. Okay, let's let's do a bit of investigating. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good evening. How are you doing, gentlemen? Why do you care? No nonsense, man. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Is Jess around? And who are you? Oh, so you know him. Arsehole owes me money. I've been looking for him everywhere. Yeah, that sounds more approachable. Yeah, no. I'm undercover. I'm a private detective. Well, say hi to Derek here, because you two are probably not going to see your money again. I'll try to find the arsehole. Have you seen him today? Hi, Derek. <coughs> <coughs> okay, let me try again. Hi Derek, when was the last time you saw him? Today, but the wimp has left early. He's scared Derek's gonna split his wig, eh? <laughs> left early? Where do you think he headed? Say you boys, home to his nagging bitch of a wife, to the gutter where he belongs. <laughs> Only ape knows. Is ape like the god in this, or? Yeah, let's find out for real if he's got a girlfriend. That, that's the whole point of this. We're not finding out where he's going. Could he be with someone now? Girlfriend? You reckon harlots are sort of girlfriends and sure. Could be one of them for all I know. Did something happen at work? I heard his contract is not getting renewed. Bastard had it coming. Did you boys spend time with him outside work? Yeah, we used to have a blast at the bite every Thursday. It's not fun anymore though. The bite. Could he be there now? If he is, be sure to let him know he's as good as dead. Good luck, Rack. Sure thing. Thanks for your help. It doesn't seem like he's liked very much by the people he works with. Um, it doesn't sound like he's cheating either. We're not gonna... Uh, okay, cool, cool, cool. But I don't want to run. So... Yeah. 14 99 for a trim. What madman would pay for something they could do at home with a pair of scissors? I know, man. I... Oh, fuck! Shoot. That's down here right there in the police booth. He'll eat my brains out if he sees me. And I better not go there. And 
seeing as how I'm dressed, I doubt the bouncer is going to let me in. So, ta-da! <laughs> Larry. Larry. What's this? Intracom. And there's nothing else down here. What does that say? Art is our only salvation from the horror of existence. Deep man, deep. Howard? Well, I'll be damned, is that you? Larry? It's me. It's been too long. What's going on, old man? I'm actually, I'm tad busy right now. Ha! Who are you calling old, you old rascal? <laughs> Alright, that's fair. Plus, these rags likely don't help my appearance any. I didn't expect to see you here, to be honest. Well, who you really expect to see anyone of note in a back alley? What's going on? What are you up to? Wait, do you live here? Live? You seen the tough crowd here? <laughs> I live at the bridge now. It's not as bad as it sounds, I guess. I don't even know if I can help. Do I have the money to help? Look at the apartment I live in, I don't think I can. Um, let, let's go to number three. Shit. Ow. Uh, when did that happen? Ran out of places to crash? What are you doing these days? I'm sorry, Larry. Not your fault. But who would have thought I'd see you again with my own eyeballs? Isn't that great? Yeah, you're right. We'll talk about it later. We'll catch up later then. A actually, I could use your help if you wouldn't mind. Not at all. What can I do for you? Have you seen an otter guy around here recently? What did he do? Awful things to his pregnant wife who is now struggling to get a divorce? <laughs> I don't know. Professional. Professional. Can't tell. Client confidentiality. Must be a shifty guy. What's he like? He is, he wears, he's about my height, Chubby wears a green hat. Hmm, yeah. He is, he's about my height, Chubby wears a green hat. I haven't seen him, sorry. I hope you find him, you, you always knew. What to do with guys like this? Come back anytime, I'm here often and hear people talk. Thanks. I'll catch you later. Bye. Bye. Well, let's see if I can show the photo. What's up? Find your guy? I'll be back when I stiff something out. Cool, cool, cool. I can't. Okay, cool. Enter a calm. No answer. Um, shit man, I guess, I guess I'm gonna have to go to the bouncer. Yo, bouncer, what's up? No entrance for raccoons, goodbye. What? That's discrimination, dude. Perhaps a couple of loans will change it. No, I ain't got cash. <laughs> My friend Carlos is waiting inside. No, he's not going to believe that. I'm sure we can arrange something, big boy. What you? Um. Okay. My friend Carlos is waiting inside. Go ask him. Yeah, of course. Get lost now, or I'll bash your head in. All right, jeez. I think I need to find another way in. Um, let's try. 
<laughs> Let's try asking nicely. Can I get inside? Still no. Don't ask again. <laughs> Hello? Okay. Maybe I've got something here that might help. Down on the shift. Damn it, if you catch inside me. You know, talk my ear off to a green trail runs hard. Who are you doing? Now on you, big old. Now on you. Oh, he's just a family friend, so I didn't do anything bad. He's just a family friend who won't stop talking to me. Carnivals only. I will, you know, if you want me to bite you, I'll bite. I'll, uh, I'll bite. Okay, well. Shit, man. I'm gonna have to talk to him. Uh oh. Howard! Come over here, boy! You've mistaken me for someone else, officer. <laughs> what are you up to, smarty butt? Found a job yet? I have my own PI agency, Downing. What the hell? Blah blah blah. If only you'd cut the bullshit and come onto the force, I can arrange that. Just ask. A poor mama. Jeez. But listen, I don't appreciate you getting into my business. How dare you, young man? When you end up in jail as a nasty druggie, don't call me. Yeah, yeah, bye. Okay, that wasn't so bad. I thought he'd talk my ears off or something. Old Orna still tending to this shop like always. Used to give me free candy when I was a kid. I should go say hi before he gets driven out by some supermarket chain. Eh, maybe next time. We just keep going further and further. Rich people clothes. One sock is more expensive than my whole outfit. Yeah. Faxi Burger. Once I got punched by a guy in a Federer, who then proceeded to puke out his not nearly digested tuna burger on my coat. Ah, the memories this place brings. Hmm. Now I can see like the the neon reflection in the water is beautiful. Oh, I love it. Good day to you, friend. Fancy some fresh news? Hmm. Sure, shoot. For a half loon, you can read them all you want with your own eyeballs. Alright, here you go. What's the headline today? Front page today's Great Ape Parade preparations underway. Celebration starts Friday. You sound so excited. <laughs> Thanks, uh, how's business anyway? Well, you tell me. People want their damn news for free and damn hawkers don't help any. Granville's getting full of them and the force don't even care. Why don't those cops care? Hawkers are small fish. Not worth the effort unless they're right under the cops' noses. You know there's a police spoof just down Granville. I've tried reporting them before. By the time an officer gets here, the hawkers are smoke. Why do they bother you so much? Well, hawkers don't worry about bills or allowance, you see. So they can afford to sell cheap, undercut honest businessmen like myself. Well, I... Okay, I know it's bad for business, but and it's bad for business. It's illegal. The city won't have, but won't give you a sales permit if you don't have a shop. And no permit means you're probably skipping income allowance. You know, peddlers, they hawk their rickety improvised stands around and collect all the profits with nary a permit. Gotcha. I'd better go. Uh, see ya. Oh, fuck's sake. 
I'll bet my tail that damn rodent with the seeds will be arriving any minute now. I'll cheer up. <laughs> Man, you can be a bit of an entire prick sometimes. <laughs> I'm tempted. Okay. Oh, cheer up, Bo. You have at least one loyal customer. Well, how about you buy something then? I've got nibbles, uh, fizzy drinks. Actually, just remembered I gotta run. I'll catch you by later though. Oh, loyal customer, my ass. Get out of here. Well, excuse me. Bye, Bo. Yeah, I've come to the end. Waka waka. <laughs> Let's go, garbage dump. Let's see, socks, takeaway boxes, cigs, aha! A ticket to the bike. Thanks, trash bin. Aha! See, that's how you make a game. If one door closes, make sure there's still enough to open for the player. There's always another way. <laughs> <laughs>